Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, God. Oh, oh. It's, As it's the end of the stagger, year. We'll stagger to the end of the year. We've Because I was thinking of a subject for today's show, but it's Desolation. just going to be uh, this year. Or I want to talk about the WD-40 I just sprayed on my leg. Uh, you, get, you get an aftershave, it's WD-40. That's pretty. And you know what? The no, ladies like it. No, they don't. They do. No, they don't. They do. The kind of women you hang about with, but no, no. They like WD-40. No, they and don't. No. they like the smell of uh, uh, petrol. No, they don't. They do. No, it's... No. That's a good... This is a, a myth. Thing. This is a myth put around by mechanics. <laughs> when mechanics are all meeting for their corned beef sandwich at half past one, yeah, they're all. You know what, guys? Fucking women, we're fighting them off. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Get your wrenches out. The women, the posse, are coming down to strip off our bloody boiler suits to get into our smells. All the ladies, and I say ladies very loosely are on you, this floor uh-huh. when there's cans of spray being. Uh. Are you Expelled. saying they like it? Women I like don't a, like it. Women like a greasy pocket. Yes, I know Susan's got a greasy pocket, <laughs> but I don't. I didn't know she liked a greasy she, pocket. Yes, they like that smell. Yeah, but you could fit a hand inside that, Susan's greasy anyway, pocket. Anyway, we filled it, with all those originals. Anyway, what the, the you know she listens to this. No, 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 she does. The abuse she gets is deserved. It but, is well know. deserved. Yeah. But at the last, so there's no snow. Day. It's it's unseasonably warm out there. Muggy. Last night I went out. The house Uh And warm air hit me And I was like What the fuck That was the reek Well I was walking home For what last night And the smell of dope In Dundee It's amazing It's Christmas came early I think they must have Just got blocks of cannabis (laughs) It's fucking reeking Dundee It's unbelievable The amount of I walked to the post office And there's a street Which seems to be Primarily pensioners But it fucking reeks and it's not just the smell where you get it's, a whiff. No. It's on your clothes it's once a, you come it's, home. It's a skunk smell. Yeah. Oh, proper skunk smell. Yeah, yeah. proper skunk but smell. But it's skunk smell that you feel it's within 12 feet of oh, you. Oh, yeah. Somebody's it's just really close. Yeah. Along, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did I tell you I was driving home from here uh-huh. at the end of summer? My window was down. Uh-huh. And the car in front oh, just, blew out smoke. Oh. But the air pressure sucked into my car right. and I got a burning throat. I went, Jesus. <laughs> like that. And oh. it was like. Because the police don't bother. Nobody bothers. But no. Dundee police don't bother with any bloody thing. I have a story about a police person. Oh, I'm not going to go into detail. Few. Okay, let's hear it. And they used to sell the weed to everyone. Of course they do. But actually, I've realised I've started that story and I can't go any further with it. No. <laughs> but I do know. I yeah. watched a truly wonderful TV show last uh-huh. night. Have I put this on? Hold on, I need to put my. Uh, oh I yeah. need to put my... This is recording, isn't it? Oh, Could God, you check? Could you just double check? It's recording. It's recording. There's a. It's on BBC iPlayer. Uh huh. So even our international listeners should be able to get it. Yes, it. okay. It's called Meet Me at the Hippos. What? Meet Me at the Hippos. And what it's about, and it's truly, as you know me, I'm a hard, hard-hearted person, but it was quite, it was quite nice. It was the new towns of Scotland, okay, and the art that was at the when Glen Rothes and all that were being built. Yeah, you'd have the architect team and the engineers, mm-hmm. and one guy sat in the corner would be the artist, and he would, when they'd, if it overordered concrete, they'd say, "Um, Malky." Make art, make something. Yes, yes. So there's famous ones of it hippos. It used to be big stuff. Yeah, big they'd what, make what things d- bigger. Well, Dundee have yeah. got the the pyramids. Yeah, and that was the same. Just but make they, stuff. The, these lovely hippos, concrete hippos, and the the essay Scottish actor guy. He go, his father uh-huh. was this like new town artist guy, and they went back and revisited all these, and they're lovely. They're really nice. There's one that's an overpass and an underpass in Glenrothes. It looks like an Aztec tomb. It's brilliant. It's a There's kind, of, kind of art I like. I love art. Well, there was a big thing when I was a kid. It was art trails. So you'd be out in the woods and you'd come across a sculpture. That's what I kind of like. Things unexpected art. Unexpected art. Meet oh. me at the hippos. Okay, I'll check that. Because we never made a pilgrimage up to the Dundee pyramids. Oh, but we, this will all happen because in the new year, once a month, we'll yeah. leave here. Do you um, know there's a junkie entombed in there? Oh, really? But these manservants, they're all kind of they're all bricked in. Yeah. Because it's got the scale. A There's wee junkie a few people fit. from the dole would go in and have to die with them. <laughs> die with them, yeah. <laughs> I wonder what a Dundee fair would be called. Toot, toot and come in. Toot, toot and come in. Oh. No. Toot and came in. Come in. 
Oh God! But anyway, uh, this is the the last day of the year. I'm on and top. M-, this, M on top. M on top. This year. Ah, uh, has it been a year? Uh, it's just drifted by. It's man. fucking horrific. It was Christmas two seconds ago. Yeah, Betty, uh, we're getting to age now. Years just like that. Just well, yeah. when you're ten, ten years, everything's new. Yeah. So everything's exciting. Your brain's got to figure <laughs> stuff Nothing's out. Nothing's new now. Nothing's new I've now. I've seen everything I want to. I don't need to see any <laughs> new things ever again. I'm done. Oh God! It's I'm just done. We'll just soon be lost in a just a, a haze of nostalgia. I'm looking forward to when oh, God, we could actually really? travel abroad again. Where are you gonna go? Ah, uh, fancy China. That's not going to fuck me off. China, fuck that. I wouldn't go to China. No. The, I've watched a documentary on how they're treating the Weechers. Oh, not, God, okay. I've got right, a wallet, okay. and I swear to God, it's made out of Weecher skin. Right, okay. It's got a bit of scalp <laughs> Mongolia. on it. Mongolia. It's, it's just, they've got these camps. They're like butlets. Oh, they're, awful. they're not quite as bad they're, as butlets. They're not as bad as butlets, but they are concentration but they're just, camps. Uh, it's fucking horrific. Yeah, that's terrible. The Chinese authorities have the long view. Mm-hmm. And they're just like fuck it. Can they do it's, Chile? It's, yes. Places like that. Yeah. Everywhere you go, there's that would an be issue quite with, nice. But there's some beautiful places. Yeah, South America would be really. Nice. Mm-hmm. I've I've been watching a lot of ones, and it's like uh, those huge trains in North America, and they've got the kind of skyliners, oh, the, the open roof, the, the can, ones that go up the Rockies. Oh. oh. See, we're now at the age where that's delightful. Yeah. And you can just sit and see these beautiful views. But that's the thing. It's the people, the problem with holidays now, the journey bit's not the holiday. Yeah. So people just get on these fucking awful planes and fly to Spain, land, and mm-hmm. then sit on the beach scratching their buttocks, whatever they want. Yeah. People should maybe the slow journey, and that's what I love about trains. Train stations are lovely, and trains are the finest way to travel. It's relax. It's all right. Take your time. Slow India. down. Have you seen the trains in India yeah. when they go past oh. the station and everyone's bums hanging out taking oh, a shit? Oh, taking a shit. But they get those uh, the boxes, the tiffin boxes comes in, and right. they have it waiting for you at the station. And oh. Those old ah oh, brown Cuba would be nice, but I've heard Cuba's kind of changed quite a bit. Yeah. They, they initially got rid of all the kind of revolutionary stuff, but that was bad for tourism, so they put all the posters back. Right. Okay. But okay. it's not the Castros anymore, is it? No. They're both. No, uh, yeah, it's going to change in time. Iceland, at all. there's so many places. To Iceland's go. meant to be. Everyone I know has been to Iceland. Expensive. Yeah, very. And but I've never been. But everyone's telling me to go. I'd love it. It's I've really heard good. they're like more relaxed Finns. <laughs> <laughs> the Finnish are a wild are lot. <laughs> wild. <laughs> I heard one smiled once. Did they? It was it was like having a stroke. Well, but. Um, I could be wrong. I stumbled upon a YouTube video and it was the Finns. When the Finns were fighting the Russians, just the, the, the war, just yeah. in the Second World War, there was a kind of, it was open, hostilities were open up. There was a sniper they had. Yes. I've, and I've, he killed I've, 525 I've, people. He didn't have a scope on his rifle. No, it's just... It's, he used to put snow in his mouth yeah. so you wouldn't see his breath. And he's been hit by a grenade. They shot, and no, they, still kept they going. They shot him, he was, a German shot him in the face with an exploding bullet and it blew his face oh, right. apart. And he still, <laughs> kept, still going. kept going. <laughs> you see him. The Finns... <laughs> Ruthless. Not, not great for uh, humour, I've heard, but no. good at killing people. Brilliant at killing people. Excellent. It's that way of killing people where they don't make a fuss. Like, and if an Italian killed you, it'd be dramatic. I've had a theory about this, though. But the Finns would quietly they'd throttle quite, you. They'd, they'd, they'd use uh, a sharpened jobby that's frozen. Aye. That's what the, yeah. Oh. But I knew a, a Finnish girl. Uh-huh. And she said that, you know, there's no pub culture in no. Finland and that, and nobody really, there's not laughing like there is here. And I thought, well, it's a bit of a stereotype. She goes, no, I don't find jokes funny. And I told her a joke, and she threw up. And I realised they've probably just never heard jokes. They've not heard your dad jokes. That's not a good... It was that's, a dad that's, joke. That's not a good entry-level thing. I said to her... But they must laugh amongst each other. What did the big chimney say to the small chimney... Oh. Okay. I keep thinking it's Tuesday. And she laughed so hard she threw up. Oh. But I just think she'd never heard the joke no, in her life. No, she didn't know how to deal with it. That was it. it was Imagine never laugh. Remember that kid show, The Boy Who Laughed? or something. Remember? No. It was on before news round. Right. And a kid was the biggest smiling, happy person in the world. And his laugh was just infectious. Okay. And the world's wealthiest man, he was like a Bond villain, bought his laughter from him. Uh huh. Because he wanted, he he ruled half the world. This guy, but to rule the other half, he had to be able to laugh and smile. And he stole this guy's laugh. Okay. And this kid and his mates were going to get it back. 
the BBC. It was a foreign thing. It wasn't programs a British. Were really bleak. Well, they'd buy shit like they'd buy um. Oh, when you used to get uh, Dog Tanya and the stuff, Three Musket Hounds, you'd get uh, Cities uh, of Gold Christmas sort of TV specials from the Czech Republic, yeah, or Czechoslovakia as it was, painted fruit, and it was nightmarish. I well, just we'd get that all the time. Yeah, we didn't get much. You couldn't sleep. John Craven was the highest, kind of the, the the cheery bit on the schedule. You know what, John Craven, not a, a pedophile, not a pedophile, and I wish he was still telling the news now. Yeah, he told it as it was. He he cut it down, trimmed the fat off. Yes, because the, that's the thing with it. Because it was for children, it had to be simplified uh-huh. without scaring kids, and uh-huh. you had to. And they confronted everything, uh-huh. but they also got it across very factually because of that. Mm-hmm. And it wasn't like news now, where it's just. I horrible. had heard that the Noel Edmonds and John Craven spit roasted Maggie Philbin. Oh, that's that that was common back Philbin. then. Why all Keith Chegwin watched Maggie Philbin Is she dead? I think she died No, che- no che- Philbin's still with us It's Chegwin that died Oh right okay Cheggers Cheggers Now wasn't pop, Maggie pop, Philbin pop, 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 An alcoholic as well As Keith Cheggwin You would need to be To have sex with Cheggers Oh that. that Amanda Holden did it But she's she's. No horrendous. that was Les Dennis She was fucking Oh my god I don't know Is that the same person? <laughs> Kinda Cheggers is just yeah. Cheggers. I get them mixed up. They're all the same person. Uh, oh, she was. Oh, that's horrible. I that's hate worse. Amanda Holden. She's, she's horrible. She's yeah. a nasty piece of shit. Yeah, she's this country specialises in dead faced bastards. Oh, she's a yeah. Plain Simon example. Cowles. Yeah. yeah, just they hang about here and they're just on my telly like Ozzy Osbourne's fucking wife. <laughs> Ozzy Osbourne's a cunt, but his wife's even worse. Have you seen his daughter, the surgery she's had done? I wish she had done. She looks completely different. I think she's had her big jaw taken away. Big jaw, yeah. She's, she's like a... <laughs> it's like Bruce Willis, can, his daughter. Yeah. Can, can... Uh, they look like D-clamps. <laughs> well, they just look like fucking Bruce Willis. <laughs> like Bruce Willis. They're, their mother's can, one of the most beautiful women yeah, of the 90s. Beautiful, beautiful women. But you get your dad's face. It's very unfortunate. That was an example uh-huh. of how you said uh, Ridley Scott is a great director. Uh-huh. G.I. Jane. I've never seen that. Oh, my God. But that's just a fetish film for her muscularity. It's It was awful. That's just her muscularity. Yeah, that was just, just her sweating in her boots. That's, have you ever seen Striptease? Oh, that's worse. But that's got... <laughs> it's got tits in it. It's got tits. But it's got tits that are quite frightening. They're not tits. They're not tits. They're not tits. They're not tits. No. no, they're not they're tits. They're stretched with an inch of bursting. Just like a well biled clooty dumpling. Yeah. <laughs> Two of them. You oh. can see her back through the front. Oh, ve- just it's not ve- good. the blue. Yeah. Oh. It's not good. Yeah, but it's just a muscular else. Oh, yeah. She, she could, could have, sit down she with, could have, with gusto. She could open a can of tenants with Jesus. Oh, my God. Last day. She had a body year. like Joe Brune with the mm. Bruins. <laughs> Joe Brown. Joe was it Joe? <laughs> oh, Joe was the one. Mean. He was the exercise one. Oh my god. Did you ever knock one off to Maggie? Hen. Hen. <laughs> <laughs> remember when Hen had a bubble car? Yeah. <laughs> you remember too much. <laughs> so if a, if our four listeners haven't watched read like the Bruins or Ur Willie, don't. The Just, Bruins and Ur Willie It's awful. Are stories about a family from Dundee. Uh, and Nobody thought it was from Dundee though They we didn't realise because they, they, had, they had a button Ben and, and that was a, a holiday uh, home uh, the, No we didn't have that Aye they shared that, the things <sighs> Grandpa had to do to get that button Ben oh my God. He'd offer up his butt and Ben Oh Jesus the, uh, I, never, I think, can you imagine the Soviets when they try to crush the UK they, They'd all been sat there, Khrushchev had been sat there Reading going, the Bruins <laughs> <they're>, This is <laughs> bleak <laughs> Leave them. You know what? We should invade and improve their we'll life. We'll improve their lifestyle. <laughs> There's what? fucking forty of them living in one house. Yeah, they've all got rickets. <laughs> one of them's got a gi- one of them's a giant, and one's a midget. Oh, oh. it was it was a different time. Oh, it's simpler time. It's still, the storylines have they got mobile phones and shit now? A microwave. They probably do, but they still live in fifties. They'll, they'll, they'll still live on. Hey, they're all the still living in the city. And that was Ur Willie would live in Sturie Bray, which is a city road, which is just two minutes from Ur here. Willie looked like one of those people who have the kind of they're they're an adult, but they've just maintained a youthfulness. And they've got like, like Ralph Ma- Ralph <laughs> oh, Ralph right. this karate I kid you're, the, not the look I've got I've just got the immaturity uh, you, you, no, you don't yeah, look, look. you're like some form of Benjamin Button I'm not sure uh-uh. <laughs> something's going the timeline's wrong next year 
which oh, is tomorrow. 2022. Now, it doesn't mean anything. Time doesn't mean anything. It's all nonsense. Do you think but... Prince Andrew will manage a shite tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he'll be fucking, he'll be guzzling the pepto bismol. Oh my god, oh, he's, the he's most nervous. stressed man. <laughs> Imagine sitting and watching this unfold for your palace. There's people sitting. I think Mary Antoinette had felt more comfortable. There's people the sitting before, waiting so. to put their chemo in uh, th- on Monday and they've got less fear <laughs> than fucking Prince Andrew. <laughs> I w- again. Oh, oh. He's getting, uh, he wants the evidence kept secret. He says, "Yeah, no, whatever happens, you've just got to keep it secret." <laughs> I think it shows you how detached that cunt is he from the rest of the world. No notion. Doesn't have a clue. Doesn't think he thinks. I no, said to you last no. week there was a a guy at the pub by me, uh, and so he was coughing, and someone said to him, uh, "You better get that tested." And he goes, "I'm not going to the doctors." He doesn't have a clue. He doesn't know. No. Prince Andrew, he doesn't he know. He does it. He's like, what? He's imagine <laughs> in a modern world, he's like that. Imagine what his people were like a hundred years ago. There's no communication. 100, no, but 150. No, but 150 years ago, Prince Andrew's lineage, yeah. they would have they would have run their horse over you. Yeah, and there would have Nobody been nothing. Did Thank you for running your horse over my children. I had too many anyway. No, it's just ah. Uh, it's oh, he's in trouble. He'll never spend a day in jail, though. <laughs> no, that's he should though. He, he, he should, should. He definitely should. Wouldn't it be a, a change if yeah? If there, they said, there, "Look, there you're getting a, five there years." There is a change. There's a change happening here. The Royals. It shows you the, the technique. What they always did. The, what you do if somebody accuses you, if somebody makes a sexual assault accusation, mm-hmm. they immediately just try and like. Blacken the person's name. That's right. They look into that's the sex life. That's history. a playbook. Yeah. A fucking prostitute on Shite Street can yeah. be raped. Yeah, it can happen. Yeah, but I mean, but they'll blacken that poor person's name, and they're trying that with this lassie, and it's not, it's not working. It's not it working. May, lawyers are always pieces of shit. Yes, but people are now like, nah, fuck. Yeah, on. people are going. No, nah, we know <laughs> no, what went on. You kind of come away with that shit. And now uh, that stupid bitch, Ghislaine, she's uh, been found guilty. We'll see how long she gets. We'll see how long she gets. She's when no, she starts getting her wee black book out. I bet she doesn't. She'll hold it. No, but I, I don't think they've got the compromise they thought they did. Yeah. He, you know what I mean? There's a lot of bullshit spoken. Jeffrey, Ar- Jeffrey Archer, he's another fucker. No, he's Je- a prick. Epstein yeah. undoubtedly was like abusing women. Mm-hmm. And he was, he, it's trafficking because he was moving women about for his own and things. Children. Yeah. Children. Ch- children. I don't think the, the over egg at the sea was running like a, an international like pedophile mm-hmm. and there was like lassies being murdered. It's no. Mm-hmm. The thing, what has actually happened is horrific enough. Yeah. It was mainly to feed his own requirements. He was just. Do you the not man think he like, was filming he, other. The people? man was liking the wank. Oh. He fucking. He was getting topless He's, hand shandies constantly. So that. And the thing is, he discarded people. Mm hmm. It was like, that's what he was doing. He was getting a girl, and then he was getting rid of her, and it was a new girl every day. Oh, he's just it's a just very psychopath. So, Jelaine was feeding this fucker's mm-hmm. habit. Do you think he'd compromise on people, this talk that he was working for Mossad? Uh, Do I think he was a, maybe a useful idiot? Yeah. There could have oh, been Moss- that. Mo- again, Mossad are very, very He thinks he's running the world, doing. and they're like, you're just Mate, doing what we the, want, yeah. The chief whip, in, the, in our parliamentary system, mm-hmm. the chief whip has information about you. And he uses that to manipulate people. That's how it's our crazy. system works. It's like I was watching a, an American right-wing politician, a yeah. young guy, thinking a wheelchair, I think right. you might recognise him. And he's splitting up with his wife, but he said in an interview he met his wife by uh-huh. an ex-American soldier in St. Petersburg who then contacted him in Florida to say there was a, a competition on, could you come down for it? And there was no competition when he got there, <laughs> and he was locked in the room with this girl, who then became his wife. What? And she's Russian. Because the I'd Ru- be like, hold on. But the Russians are masters at it. So they were just like, these fools are just getting... It's a honey trapped right. and all kind. Do you want to know why I couldn't be honey trapped? Right. Some beautiful woman comes up to You'd me. You'd be like, it's like you go, you fucking, you, you spy. Are? What are you? <laughs> I've got a mirror, you can't. I know what I'm I like. Do. <laughs> Uh, uh, oh, I'm inter- uh, Even if the girl uh, wasn't that hot, really? she goes, "I'm a woman interested in you." You uh, go, "You fucking spy." But uh, <laughs> no. yeah, yeah, he's f- but he, 
the, I get this, the thing that seemed to be about him, I'd never met the man, but he was dealing with a lot, like Bill Gates is a very wealthy man. You put that but, in strangely, but I never met him. I never met him. <laughs> but he's, he's, he's socially inept. Yeah. These are nerds, and they've spent their whole time coding stuff. They don't know women. They don't know yeah. anything. And here's this Epstein, and he was like a kind of exaggerated version of a guy just like with women. Yeah. Women hanging off his arm. And they were attracted to him, and then he says, come on the plane, rock star. Like to, yeah. to them, he was a rock star. Mm-hmm. And that's how he played his game. Clinton was on the plane. There was Everybody was on the fucking Everyone. plane. I think Clinton... I get the feeling Clinton doesn't like wee lasses. Clinton's into a bigger girl. Yeah, he likes an older... He likes uh, Idaho he likes farm a, girls. a bit of meat on but that But there's bone. a load of shit, but people... People, re- that's how the world's done. It's, it's so s- sickeningly awful. Politician, isn't it? powerful people. It's just like the local golf club. They all know each other. They all mingle. It's yeah. yeah. That's yeah. how I could never but be a no, politician. I don't like people. No, I, don't I don't like, like to deal people. with them. I don't like to deal with them. I don't but want to talk Andrew, to anyone. the minute he lied about that photograph, no, that's not me. It's You're like, like fucking hell. If you get a lie about that, mate, I've had experts look at it. It's not my fingers. You're a fucking. You fucking liar. He's a prick, and his arrogance has fucked him. If he had just kept quiet. Yeah, say nothing. That interview was beautiful. That interview's the greatest piece. That I was, that was I watch great. that once every three or four months. <laughs> it's it's, it's wonderful. A great, uh, Emily Maitlis is just superb. It's forensic. It's just yeah. let him fuck himself because she shut the fuck up when she yeah. needed to, Don't and he went. And and he was adding stuff. It's like shut Ken, the fuck up. If he'd up. given a Piers Morgan, Morgan would have spoke over him. Yeah, and, and actually dug him out. Yeah, again. Pretending to get after him, but not giving no, him opportunities. It, yeah, because he's Mate, a piece of shit as well. Yeah. But Mate List just But she just there. let that happen. And Give you saw little... this arrogance. I can talk my way out of this. Yeah. Meh. Oh, brilliant. People so are stupid and I'm great. That's when I bring down the royal family. Though. Nah. They're, okay. they're in, they're just, they'll go forever. They'll cut, them off like an, they'll cut them off like a rotten limb. Well, publicly and in the background, you're all right. Well, we I, know what we'll do I here. don't think they like him anyway, Charles. There's a lot of Isn't intrigue Isn't it Edward that doesn't like him? Well, Edward's been brought back into the fold. Yeah. They're, they're using, brought him back. He's back. Mm-hmm. Fucking hell. They're not like you and us. he's not gay anymore, is he? No, he's not gay anymore. No, he's not gay. <sighs> but what no, it makes do? me. It just makes me laugh. And everybody's like, oh, the Queen's having a hard time. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a shit about her. I don't give a shit. Who gives a fuck she's about her? She's not some old wifey sat in the bus stop. That's she's right. Not, That's she's right. Like, I have very little sympathy for people that sit in castles. Think of the fucking ego. Huh? That you're the head of the Bank of England. It's your money, your and face you say, the... I want my face... On uh, that money, that's money. If you'd started doing shit like that, you'd be sectioned. They'd be like, "What?" I'd be no hesitation. Yeah. But it's nothing. It's just, just. If t- t- you even started a, your own Bitcoin now, but uh, with your face on it, oh, people would say it's a joke. N- now, if you were serious, oh. they'd go, "His ego's gone. You got to get." There's an intervention. Oh, do you know that guy, Niall Naomi? No, Niall Naomi has built the largest private residence in America. Okay, it's called the One. The one you heard of the one? I've not. It's in LA. It's on top of. He built a. He, it's constructed out of like a mountain, and on top of it is a house, and the house is like, oh, ten times bigger than this building. Jesus, okay. It's maybe bigger than that. It's okay. huge. It's got an indoor everything, everything. Who, a who garage. This? Fuck no. But it, the it, it, ten years it took him to build, mm-hmm. mainly with a lot of coke energy. He's gacked as fuck. Okay, you see him, okay. Cokey guy. Um, it's got its own art gallery within it. It's fucking crazy. You'd have to see it. In ten years, and he's built it. He's won five hundred million for it. Oh my! It's God. late stage capitalism. Yeah, that's just. But the madness. thing is, if you have five hundred million to spend in a house, you get build it yourself. Mm-hmm. You don't want to buy someone else's. You know what I mean? Yeah. If you're so, if I've got if, half a billion, I'm, I'm designing it. I'm designing it myself. Yeah. I'm not getting it built by this cloud. My flat would be amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So he he. <laughs> It's not sold, and he's now it's he's not paid his his bills. He's, he's he, the debtors. What's the tax on that a year? Well, just in LA, you have to pay fifty million. You have to pay, but you have to pay just existence. To, yeah, huge yeah. millions. There's millions a year, of years. just for it to sit there. That's yeah, insane. There. And you wouldn't get to build it now because the regs have all changed. This mm-hmm. place. anyway, they're trying to sell it because he owes them money, and he's outraged. So how he's he's come up with a system? So he's been he's been teasing this on the internet for a while. And it's like he reckons is now billions. He can make billions. Mm-hmm. He's coming up with a Bitcoin, oh. a cryptocurrency. So what you're saying is you buy the cryptocurrency and that gives you shares in this house. And he reckons it's going to change the world because it's going to be concerts in it. 
Oh, he's, he's if you get a chance, he's kidding himself. He, we'll married, he married a woman during lockdown and divorced three weeks later. He's fucking so coked up. It's like Roy did just fucking frenzy. Just he was going to build a god plane. A god plane. A god plane. It was going to save that the world. Incredible. He's going to fly about. Just he's he's a blue sky thinker. Oh god, that just means. But he's nonsense. Be, like I say. But he is like. This is like the royal family. Yeah. He, but late stage capitalism you mentioned there. Do you mm. know what comes after that? Death. No, forever. Nothing. Well. It just it, it peaks and uh, then it'll go down to a trough mm. where people will start um using trading again and yeah. you know like we're talking about uh the shops will work if you bring in things you can't get online, like a seamstress and you yeah. get close. Yeah. Things like that. But it'll go back to trading. It'll yeah. go back to these sort of things. Yeah. It's we not do, a huge collapse. It just yeah, we moves do, on. We're just there's too much plastic shit. Like you're saying about mm-hmm. the yeah the shit that comes inside crackers. We don't mm-hmm. need that. Don't That's need true. It. We don't need it. But, but it looks like this. There's there's something that happened. And just the whole way work is done. How people give yeah, their work. This Everything's is, we're on things the, are changing. And I hope it happens smoothly and it doesn't it, get you know, a wee bit. It, real, it kind uh, of will. Aye. Because when places get rich mm-hmm. and then. It's termed historically as a collapse, and it mm. sounds collapse sounds mm. terrible. It's not. It's just things change, uh, for the better of some people. Like I watched and another one, and it was the a million pound Mercedes Benz, like Winnie Bago, right? Okay, which is like a huge like Optimus Prime thing, and it's got a car, yeah, and a garage in it, and the car comes out the bottom, comes out the and, bottom. Yeah. And you're like, you can't fucking drive the thing anyway. You couldn't ex- you, you couldn't own it in Scotland. Where no, would you, you go? Can't. You couldn't even turn the corner you in Scotland. You'd, you'd, you'd be fucked. You'd be, it'd be delivered. You'd go, how'd you get out of my house? It's just <laughs> fucking ridiculous, yeah. this stuff. But I, the, the way... Somebody told me that Elon Musk, my favourite, is was the wealthiest man in the world for a while. That's just not true. Well, he's now worth... It went up to 333. I think it's 233 billion he's worth. How? Doesn't make any. No, it doesn't. Doesn't... I was there's a radio thing the other day. I was listening to podcasts, and we're just there's people on saying how wonderful he was and all this shit. But this is the same as do you remember when it it's was all made the up. money's bullshit? The internet sort yeah. of blew up in the oh, early two thousands. The bubble. And if you started a business, it yeah. was worth t- twenty thirty million, and you hadn't even sold anything. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it was it's kind of like that. That's everything he does. Is NFTs, ba- NFTs. But anything Elon started. Musk does is based on like uh, science fiction books from his childhood. He just makes stuff He's up. just a nerd fanboy guy. But yeah, he doesn't make any His haircut's st- amazing. Still waiting for that robot. Ah, that robot. <laughs> he says it's coming this, next year, which is tomorrow. Aye. So, fingers crossed, we'll have a dancing but how robot. how long can that go on? Just make saying stuff's coming and it never comes. I think the collapse, when it comes, right, is when ordinary people, especially young men, Aye. are going to stop investing in stupid shit. Now, NFTs... Because he's making people money. People are buying them. But he's, Musk's making money from small amounts of money. People, yeah. people are paying up front for stuff. But it's, it's relatively wee amounts of money. He's, yeah, he, uh, when he put his uh, cyber truck, yeah. the deposit was $100 yeah. or something. So yeah, he got just, these thousands and thousands yeah. of deposits. Can go to the bank and say, look at all these deposits yeah, for these yeah, expensive yeah, yeah, yeah. cars. The cyber truck, the, the batteries were... Weighed more than the stuff the cyber truck was going to transport. And then the cyber truck is too large; it wouldn't be allowed in Europe. So there's loads of things in the. Was shape that the of it cyber and... truck? It looked like a kind of weapon of war. It was like yeah. stealth technology. Yeah. Oh, that thing didn't work. I remember watching uh, Simone Yutch. She, she makes crap robots on YouTube. She's right, okay. I really like her, and uh, she went to the launch. Now she made her own. Uh, Tesla truck by cutting off the back of a Tesla and, and she does stuff like this and it's always mad but really interesting and it was the unveiling and it, the curtain went back and there's the car and her face went and that's all you needed to know this yeah. is someone who's very technical and Aye. engineer she yeah. knows her shit and yeah. she just went what the fuck it's the bamboozle but they it's say- for people that don't own trucks now right okay they don't the, know how practical the, it's they say be. what's good ab- what, what his strategy is though it's risk Mm-hmm. They say there's nobody quite like it for really pushing the risk and just going for it. So everyone will just collapse. Well, it's not your money. It's very easy. <laughs> People like him never invest their own money. Yeah, never. That's his top secret of investment. Never put your own money. I was reading the thing in the paper the other day. Some tough guy down in England. We've paid three hundred and thirty grand to tarmac his drive. I saw that. These potholes. Now why is this shit still going on? It's still going on. 
So they go, oh, no, remember the guy got his duck pond? That's right, yeah. And uh, they say, that's all put an end to. Things have changed. No, it's, the, it's no, never going to change. still just going it's on. It's going to go. Well, we know our MP we've talked about, he, yeah, he, yeah. he's a man that wants to do away with that the whole thing. He's taking his money while he can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. I've never had the expenses, Tit. I, I would just, I'd be greedy on it, though. I've never. I'd be greedy on it. Oh, I was. No, I was right. I got expenses with my job. It uh-huh. was to get. Um, that was for under a hotel. Uh huh. Right. Uh-huh. And it was. Uh, but what I would do, instead of staying down You'd in sleep in your car, London, no, I commuted on the bus, and it was really cheap. So I would uh, go down on the bus. Uh huh. Right. Oh, this is so bleak. Instead of the train. Mm-hmm. Do my work for the day and then come back at night, return ticket, and just sleep there. Ah. Uh. And I would do that, and then I'd be a day back in Dundee, then back again, and you'd save some money, and I would have some extra cash. Oh. Then I got found out someone fucking grasped on me. Oh, I was always doing somebody. it. And I went, but I'm saving you money. Aye. It says, because I'm not taking the full amount. Aye. It's only an extra 20 quid or something. And they went, no, no, you've got to get a hotel. And it was like, oh. I was like, but you're getting, I'm paying the bus fare and a hotel now. Oh. That's ridiculous. But. Uh, they, they felt I was pulling a fast one, so they'd rather pay more money. Aye. And I was like, that's ridiculous. Mm-hmm. What, what have we got tonight? This is Hogmanay. It's going to be quiet, I think. Yeah, it's going to be quiet. And I don't celebrate New Year at all. I have no interest. No, I like to see the bells. I don't. I like to see the clock. Oh, click God. over that. Just, oh, it's fine. Bed. It's all bollocks, really. I don't like it. it. I don't like it. Uh, Especially... The way it used to be in Dundee was just a lot of drinking, well, a lot the, of vomit. Well, Dundee, uh, people think Hogmanay is wonderful in Scotland. Edinburgh and that, they always have a big hootenanny, but... Like, Dundee you know, is like Dundee. a war zone. Well, the they, they don't centre. even have... You could go down to the city centre, there'll be nobody there. Well, they used to put on, like, a fun fair and that, but that goes off at, like, eight. Yeah. So it's just people... Yeah, drunk and, drunkenly making oh, their way back. Yeah, it's horrible. I assume that, eighth, that winter fair thing in City Square, you can't <laughs> really... Dance about in that. That's just going to be trash. Get splinters. Yeah, that's going to be. I've never yet to see anybody on that. I've, I'm still. Got, I think it's a photo opportunity. Okay, is that what it is? It's just an Instagram thing. Yeah, it's kind of like that. Everything's like that. A lot of art is just designed to be Backdrops. an Instagram. Oh no, hundred percent. And it's like, no, make art for art's sake, I think. Yeah. Rather than a, a, uh, a further purpose of I'm, Instagram. I'm, I'm, Instagram cheapens everything. It really does. Yeah, it's people, they're not living in the moment. They're just living to get the photograph to tell people they're living in the moment. Yeah, that's it. And it's like, I like the videos of people filming other people doing Instagram How many folk fall off stuff? Oh, it's it's very common. Cliffs and that. There's been lots of deaths just for the gram. Jesus Christ. That's mental. That's bleak, isn't it? it is. And living in the moment is definitely something. Because we've talked about this before, but I watched the... A fireworks display and then I saw a concert and everyone's filming it nobody's going to watch that back no no you never know nobody film you know you why no and no. then if you see what you filmed and they're all vertical uh, it looks like shit have some still photographs to, yeah, for your memories but, just for yeah you know what I mean but you're not going to watch it you know no like a Daniel O'Donnell I, I concert say, uh, yeah exactly but I used to say when I'd go to gigs uh-huh. there was no recording of it or anything like that but it turns out you hear me singing oh. at an in excess concert. Oh, Jesus How God. bleak is that? I went because Jesus Jones were supporting them. Jesus Jones, yeah. <laughs> I like Jesus Jones. So I went uh, to see Jesus, Jesus Jones. Are they still touring Jesus Jones? They still are. Oh. In excess, um, well, they are, actually. They are. They've got someone else. Was it, they're Terence Trent Darby for a while, but they've swapped out. What's his name now? King Longhorn, the, the something he's changed Longhorn his name. Beetle the fifth. Yeah, he's, he's a his he's name. a damaged kind of guy. He's unusual, but he's a wonderful singer. Turn Strength Darby's all got a wonderful voice. I really like him. Uh, yeah, he was, yeah. He, was, he was big for a while. Mm-hmm. Big for I don't know who the, the but singer. his second album. Ah, uh-huh. uh, if you ever want to hear an ego-led project, neither fish nor flesh. Oh, it's like listening to. You know, if you get a headache where you see light, yeah, it's like listening to the soundtrack to that. Yeah, well, he he did. He only had one kind of hit. A wishing well was his biggest one. But uh, yeah, he was like Sting. We better not Sting. Seal. We better skin. Yeah, kind of. Seal. Kinda. The seal still going. Seal will still be uh, going around with a, a suit singing one song. Oh, uh, 
it's bleak, isn't it? He'll have his Vegas residency. There's, there's a real no bleakness to a lot of this stuff. It's mm. like the guys out of Bross, his taut skin. Poor bastard. The actor ones seems totally normal. Oh, no, I wouldn't <laughs> go that far. He's no, more, I, he is more normal he's in more comparison. Normal, but, no, I don't know. You see him in interviews and he's like, he he's knows a, who he is. He's a quiet... No, but he does that thing like he'll wear... He'll, be, he'll have like a Metallica t-shirt on his concert. Oh, that's that's okay. But he he seems he's aware. He's of less who he was. tutored about with. But the other guy, oh, his fucking, brother, he's, he's insane. That's Vegas. Did energy. you watch the? Oh, it's the greatest thing. It's yeah. the, the if no one's but, seen it, watch the. I can't remember what it's called, it's, and it's the Bros uh, documentary from uh, just a couple of oh, years I ago. Don't know. It's amazing. Uh, yeah, they're just like the, the little bits of wisdom he comes out with. And even his brothers go, "What are you want about?" <laughs> but it's just Vegas. It's yeah. just when you've got an entourage, mm-hmm. you don't uh, you don't you just say any old shit, and people think Mariah Carey will think she's very smart. Oh, she'll believe it. Yeah, people just see this is fascinating. She pays people. To but she's to genuinely her. thick. There's not oh, a lot. Has she on. married some billionaire? But I think she's. I don't I don't know if they've done it or not. Mm. Celebrity. We're needing a bit of a call of the celebrities. I saw a photograph and it was all the Beckhams, just the brood. Oh, I'm, I'm done not, with them. Every one of them's a waste of time. Yeah. <laughs> just these laddies. And what do any of them do? But just, they've all got this look well, like they're important. They're, they're the new Royal. Not a, yeah, they're the new Royal family, absolutely. As much, I, I hate he's the not Royal. a photographer now, he's a, a chef. Is he? He's a chef. And, uh, oh, but he's got those... He's got those uh, Will Smith slad, and they have eyebrows that go down the way because they're just so. I get everything. Uh, I just get everything. That's, uh, they're so expectant. But what kind of chef? Not in like a, not working properly hard chef. Oh, no, it'll be a TV chef. TV chef. It'll be like he won't go out and but do chefs. All, you, at least you could say the royal family have <laughs> hundreds of years of history behind them. It makes for interesting stuff. But the so Beckham, does my family. The Beckham, and uh, a lot of it's not good. The Beckhams. <sighs> and the Beckhams are the, the Ramses. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're the yeah. worst. The Ramses just, and the Beckhams. It's, they're, they're all awful. Oh, just awful people. They just have got no interest in them. Who's back with a big, in, in a lot of stuff, Don French? Don French back? Yeah, where the fucking hell Don French? Who's Don been French. like, I wish Don French was on my TV, man. <laughs> She played a minister or something, oh, didn't she? Oh, fuck knows what she did. They she always used to say, look, big, big women are attractive. Look, Don French. Like, no, Don no, French isn't not, attractive. No, no. I didn't see that. But a lot, Lenny Henry, you've not, I told you, Lenny Henry's playing a, a mountain elf. He's a serious actor a serious now, actor so he's going to be in Well, some... Don French is in uh, um, Death on the Nile. Is she? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh, but Death on the Nile, that's, what's his name? That directed Thor. Uh is it? Proper actor guy. Oh, he I plays, yeah. Irishman. What do you call him? He, Emma Thompson was married to him. Yeah. Brada! Kenneth Brada! That's him. Oh, God almighty. He, no, uh, he's like insufferable. Like, you ever seen Frankenstein? No. Where he rolls about with Robert De Niro. He's, he's oh, Victor. yeah, I saw that. Oh, oh jizz. It's a big bath of jizz. That's weird. You see both their assholes. This is not good. No, it's not good. You don't want to see that. What, what, you're a right. You're a, you're starring in your film, and you're the director of the film. And you're like, this film needs my puckered asshole covered in lubricant. <laughs> nobody, nobody's, to be fair, nobody's, I would probably go down that route myself. Nobody's, nobody's we're making a film next year. Nobody's here to say, Kenneth. Nobody wants to see your greased up asshole. We're making a film <laughs> next year. Oh Jesus! You've been Christ. warned. Oh God! I'll start collecting other films. The buckets of other films. I've still not seen June. Oh okay. I only seen. What June. have I seen? No, nothing. I haven't watched anything in the last no, few days. No, I told you I watched The Matrix. Oh, I've been oh, waiting for a, you a need to watch download. It. Oh, there's a good... It's a Watch it tonight. Okay. It's the worst film. Oh, God. I'm I watched the new, I watched the new Resident Evil film. Oh, that looks shit. Oh, I've been... Mate, it's just... It's, 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 it's shite. It's a hundred times better than the new Matrix film. No. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. That's how bad The Matrix is. I can't explain to you how bad oh, it is. no. I can't explain to you. Susan would watch it because it's got Keanu in it. Yeah, and she did stalk him. She did. Sniff she sat him. behind she him and sniffed him. She chewed, chewed off a lock of his hair. <laughs> she did. I, I said, so how was he? And no, oh, he's a lovely chap. Oh, you know, I had a good lovely. conversation with. Him. No, no, no. Smell lovely. Uh, I mean, oh, you don't say that. Don't uh, say that. But he's, he's just you're just like oh, for the love of Christ. Mm. Uh, Not good. But I think there's a quote in the film that. The, it was going to go ahead 
with or without them, and it refers to they no, were they making get, the Matrix. Well, the Matrix exists in this film. Yeah, but they're, going, they're the, going to make this film a, whether the Wachowski yeah, is in it or not. There's, so. a, there's a Matrix video game and a film. I don't like this. It's meta. It's meta beyond meta. It's just ridiculous nonsense. Well, that's what happens, isn't it? If it's meta within meta, then oh, it's just bullshit. It's just biting its own tail. It just uh, appalling. And meta has to be subtle. You oh, can't... And you were saying they're just showing clips from the old... You, Oh, yeah, not clips. I would say for two hour, two and a half hour movie, there's a good hour of clips. Oh, what see. It's just lazy shite. Is that just them saying, fuck off, Warner Brothers? Yeah, just fuck off. Fuck we'll off. kill this franchise yeah. so you'll never make yeah. another one. And it has. It's, it's I think killed it's, it. Yeah, it's killed it. We've all said there won't be a sequel to it. That's it. And they're done. So oh, this yeah. this is probably just a... Yeah. None of this stuff... Fucking hell! There's a new Jurassic Park. What they've oh, done is terrible. they've ruined, the Jurassic they've ruined all the childhood stuff, mm-hmm. and now they're coming after all <laughs> my teenage years. <laughs> okay, and all the early twenties, all the nineties stuff is yeah. getting spoiled as well. Were you a teenager in the in two thousand? No, the nineties. Oh 90s. right, I saw you. oh no, okay. <laughs> so they're just they're just <laughs> a boy. They're just getting rid of all that. They're just getting to work their way through everything because they don't do anything original anymore. That's originality, true. late stage capitalism, it's all just rehash. It's like a squeeze well, out Well, if you T-bun. watch The Player, um, and that was what, 91 or something? Right. And then that, the. the Oh, that Altman thing. Yeah. You know? yeah. And it's they're saying, look, you could just open a newspaper and there's a story there. Yeah. And they're like, well, why don't we get rid of the director as well and get rid of the sound? And they're going, actually, if we could. And it's kind of, yeah. Right. It, it's films by committee. But yeah. there are films out there, there's great stuff. Netflix are doing better because at least they try something or they'll buy a film yeah. that you've never seen. Or they'll, 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 give, they'll give some foreign directors, little foreign directors, Netflix. There's no country, is there's there? There's no country, it's that's international. It's just it's a whatever global. director, yeah. But they, they just give money to people. So everything, that's this fucking good look. There's a new Korean thing, is it the Silent Sea or something? Oh, yeah, that, that looks, looks good. good. That looks but good. that's be- they're now better than American stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the yeah, special yeah. effects and everything they have and the now. acting quality and acting. is ridiculous. Yes, They're yeah. so good. Yeah, handsome people, the Koreans. Mm-hmm. They are considered the best looking. Within all the the people over what? there, not Dundonians. No, the 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 Japanese and the Chinese they all kind of look. They'll discuss each other, mm-hmm. like we go on about the French and the Germans. Yeah, and the Koreans are seen as the best lookers. So they like a lot right. of meat, so they the tall, tall, tall people. Oh right, people. okay. Well, great bowmen. Oh right! Okay. I'll shoot you right in the face with oh, a bow God, and arrow. That's something to look forward to. What was no. I watch? I watched that show on YouTube. The people that make the swords. Oh right! They made the Klingon weapon. Oh my God! And I thought, who are they going to dress nerd. up as a Klingon? <sighs> what you can tell by that <laughs> stupid was it called the Matlach? Oh, I don't it's, know. It's utterly <laughs> useless. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's just yeah. awkward. It's awkward. So you'd end up killing yourself yeah. with it. You're holding it in the back. You're it doesn't holding do anything. <laughs> <laughs> It'll bend over you, you see them They go like that And they stab it Into a pint of milk And it just gets Stuck <laughs> in the table <laughs> Oh fuck It's so the stupid The internet Is full of endless stuff I've given up Watching rusty tools That they, they make Non-rusty anymore Yeah Because it's fake fury, rusty really too much You want to see real rusty And you can tell It's just been kept In salt water For a few days It's just too much rust There's too much Too much rust Yeah I don't I like I think it. they often do get some And it's a bit rusty But the mm-hmm. extra And I tell you the one They said They'd found a, a Rolex watch Inside a concrete block Oh yeah Nonsense <sighs> What nonsense <sighs> I've What I've realised With the internet Is there's still Because we were talking About how Slick, it's getting a lot of channels like this. Look at we've got proper lights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's you don't want it to be TV. No, but there's still madness out there. Well, I, people I don't like know this. Just I have mad shit. I've got a couple of pistols under this table, and oh. if we start to get a bit Noel Edmondsy, <laughs> I'm just gonna shoot you in the face and then shoot myself. You need two guns for that. Yeah. Oh, a single shot muskets. Muskets. <laughs> Let's go. <cool. laughs> Who would download it though? If I if I, if it was a suicide pact, who would who would put it on the internet? The, you know, Dundee police would come in here and they go, "It's on camera. Uh, get on YouTube. I'll get it's on hilarious. YouTube." Yeah, uh, we wouldn't make. Imagine if we started making money then. If we started, that would be a. I would. I'd rise. Would, uh, be our biggest hit. <laughs> I'd rise from beyond the grave. I'd crawl it. We had four hundred downloads the other day. Oh, jeez, well, people have got nothing else to That's do. Right, yeah, they're hunkered down for the end of the world, basically. Well. I would say people are watching Don French. You know what I mean? Oh, for fuck sake! Fr- Vicar of Dibley. That's it. Have you Jesus. seen the one Murder in Paradise? No, I've, I'm yet to see it. But it's like 
fucking Midsummer Murders. Can it's very formulaic right, okay. shows? Yeah, but it's it's murder in paradise. But it's a what small was paradise I- about it's it. It's a small island somewhere. Oh right, in the Pacific Ocean. So I fuck, I don't know. But people are just getting bumped off. Just getting killed. It's an island. Murder she wrote style. Yeah, I murder. loved Murder She Wrote. I thought that was so charming. There was a charm. It was ridiculous, to it. and they there knew was, it. And they was just a, went, "Here's another it, murder." It was, it was a great. lot of really washed up actors. Yeah, in it. it was wonderful. Yeah, I kind of liked it. Yeah, and because of the even when early on when it was out, people kind of had a lot of love for it very quickly. Lansbury's so lovely. Though. She's a charm. Yeah. What about a diagnosis murder? I loved that. Yeah, that's I charm enjoyed that. Too. Yeah, it's because again, the, it knew what it was. Yeah. Let's just enjoy the process. The nonsense. Yeah. Monk. Did you ever watch? Monk? I didn't watch Monk. Tony Shalhoub. Yeah, I like him though. He's wonderful, Tony He's Shalhoub. He's good. It's got um, Buffalo Bills in it. Buffalo Bills. Oh, yeah, cock. yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah, guy tucks his cock and balls between his legs. He um, He's in it. Yeah, T- that's Ted, 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 Ted Levine. Right, I like, yeah, I like that. Yeah, if it knows what it is. Yeah, if there's but, a, a little wink and it's, but it, it's, you've got to keep it soft and charming. But these but, aren't, these, but they're not, these are too cynical. If they're too cynical, you got to watch like Street Hawk. Too cynical. Ah, Street Hawk. That wasn't too cynical. <laughs> oh, cynical. <laughs> cynical. Street Hawk was in. Were you a Blue Thunder man or a, a, a Airwolf man? Oh, now that's a that's a tricky one. I'll tell you what why. What would win in a fight? Soundtrack, Airwolf. Uh huh. Helicopter, Blue Thunder. Yeah, better helicopter. Yeah. Do you know that they brought back? When Jean Michel Vincent ended them, they, they, they got rid of him. And they brought. Jean Michel Vincent. Is it Jean Michel Vincent? Jean, Jean Michael Jean Vincent. Michael Vincent. I had no legs. He got his face bitten off by a dog and everything. Not oh, good. God. Not good. But he's dead now. Yeah, yeah, he's died. But they brought it back Team Airwolf. Team and Airwolf. Santini got bumped off, but he never. they didn't have Borgin back. They just saw the back of his head. And they, they just showed clips from the old series. They just rehashed. Right. But uh, what's his name? Van D- Barry Van Dyke was in the hot oh seat. Oh, my God. I didn't know that. Barry Van Dyke. He's oh, a good he? age now. Stop scratching your leg. It goes through that every was time. Was he in the Van... Uh, uh, was it in the... Oh, was it Knight Rider? Do you know he, Knight Rider came back with a red car? And David Hasselhoff had stubble in it. No. They brought it back in, the, like, 91. Barry... Van Dyke was in Battlestar Galactica yeah, and a the, flying the, bike. No, the shit one when they came yeah. back to Earth. They come and back the, to the Earth kids and, could fly. Oh, I don't like that. Battlestar Galactica wasn't a much cop either. Uh, the 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 TV movie yeah. that was in America was released in cinemas here. Yeah. Jesus. I went to see it. I was oh. taken to see it. Jeez, God, no Star Wars, was no, it? No, it wasn't. It was a, a, a cuddly toy. Oh, the dog thing. The dog thing that had like spider eyes. Oh, it's fucking weird as fuck. It's all fucking <laughs> There's one episode I remember. They don't go to planets like he- heavenly, but they're eating everybody. Oh, that sounds it's like, familiar. Yeah, it's like, fuck, yeah this I like is too that, good yeah. to be true. And they, you, can they just open an unlocked door? They just... But isn't that the, always the way? You go, well, we're on a planet. It's really nice here. Yeah. No. They're you can't it. enjoy anything. No, you can't. Uh... But I bet there is a planet out there. There's a lot of planets. And there's some species, and they've figured it out. And they go, oh, this life's good. Right. And we've got enough challenge, which does it keeps us from being bored, and they're, they're, everything's just fine. It's not utopia. I don't think that's all right. No? No. It's not the way life works, is it? Life, too, it's the, t- the endless time. There should have been someone, but things would have come and gone. Oh, yeah. I think there's been, there'll be life in other planets, but we'll never meet each other. Oh, yeah. Because we're all just. Yeah, yeah. Fl- we're all briefly sparking into existence that's and right. disappearing away. That's right. Because I just don't think as a, an. Ex- a, 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 a society could survive for a million years It just can't And, and it is, would need to, but to then, have, How about this one? How long has humanity been around for? How many thousand years? Well Nothing just Well in the scheme nothing of, as a, a, And as a, a species that can actually communicate with Yeah Nothing Five minutes Nothing two, Seconds you yeah. know? So There's actual planets out there mm-hmm. That the atmosphere on it mm-hmm. Will be incredibly conducive to life Yeah Everything will be good for it, but the atmosphere will be too thick for them ever to be able to leave. Yeah. The gravity mixed with the atmosphere, they'll never have the that, technology. That, do you think that Voyager thing they sent out, do you think an alien one day will just knock one off at the naked... F- no. Big, do no? you want to know why? Why? We can look through telescopes uh-huh. back to almost the beginning of the universe. Right. And that light photon has been travelling for billions of years and yeah. has never encountered anything. Mm. Until it hits our eye, and then it stops its journey. The, have you seen the new 
telescope and it unravels. Um, the shield is it working? I've been okay? quite tense I because I've been watching it. My fucking shower curtain sometimes doesn't work. Exactly, and um, they're doing this with a ten billion dollar. <laughs> And they're all sitting there. <laughs> oh, I couldn't take that. They'll be more backed up in Prince Andrew. <laughs> oh, fucking oh. No, they're not as worried as Prince not Andrew. As worried. <laughs> Prince Andrew's the most worried man it's ever been. <laughs> good. Oh, it's good. I'd love good. to. I'd love to give him a call. Good. Just say, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> you prick. No, hang, on. hang on with him. <laughs> this is the time to get him. He's needing friends. <laughs> nobody he will answer as well because nobody's phoning him. He has no friends. Nobody, the thing is, nobody will ever be seen with him again. You can't. You can't no. do it. So nobody will, apart his own children, and they'll be dodging him a wee bit. Imagine. Because they're hoping to exist. Go yeah. through rural England, and your right. car breaks down, and you're walking in the rain, and you're waving someone down, and a Land Rover pulls up, and you go, <laughs> uh, <laughs> just on you go. Your fucking foot's, your foot's caught in a man trap. <laughs> oh, no, no. I'll chew my leg off. <laughs> he's Prince fucked nah. And even like that even He's still if, married He's not got a wife just now is he? He's fucked Well Well that uh, ratty that, ginger bastard She he's stands ma- by pals, yeah. yeah she says I'm going to stand by him That uh, piece of she's shit a She's a, a piece of shit Toe sucking well. fuckwit Well she <laughs> She got She bloody got money from Epstein She got a loan What? Epstein She was in some financial difficulty And Epstein gave her some money And Andy was not one to pay it back this is amazing. It's all fucking fuck the lot, lot of fuck them. The lot of them. Fuck the lot of them. Fucking mate, do we the money you get, you fucking <laughs> greedy cunt? Can <laughs> everybody's got in a bit of difficulty and your mum maybe bungs? Imagine your mother's the queen. You just get to go through life it's like fuck easy. He cares. And you know what? He'll be loaded, and he's looking at his bank account tonight, going means nothing. <laughs> means nothing. Imagine being wealthy. You can't go anywhere. Well, America, you'll never be able to go he to can't again. Go there. Yeah, they'll arrest them, and yeah, they will. He can't, so he'll never get back to America. Again, India's not as f- f- to welcoming to the royal family as it once been. No, the, the, the Dubai goal. are going to go, dude. They, oh, they do, uh, Dubai. We've got enough reputation. We don't need you oh, here. Probably oh. do. You'd, oh. <laughs> He's going to be in a wee run. Gilded, a gilded. Gilded cage a for gilded the rest of his cage. life. Oh, wonderful. Well, I, I his daughters are right couple of fannies as oh, well. Oh, they're idiots they're as well. They're weird looking, yeah, aren't they? they're weird people. The whole fucking royal family. But Got that inbred thick neck thing going on. Yeah. Yeah, you get yeah. the thick neck. Oh, the Britney Andrew. Spears neck. Oh, How's she, she doing? I'm worried about oh, her. Oh, no, is she married yet? Is she? Oh. oh, you know, it's like all the people are free Britney, free Britney, and yeah. then they lose interest in her. They lose interest, and now she's losing her mind. The first thing she did was take flying lessons. Did she? Her pet. Get out of that fucking plane. Did she? Yeah. Oh, fuck. She's never been the brightest. Her dad's a piece of shit. Oh, they're so all they're doing shit was terrible. Yeah, of course but it was. But she's... It's not like this suddenly happened to her. She was a cash cow for the minute. Yeah. She was from yeah. a child. From a child. It's terrible. It's like poor Michael Jackson was a dirty pedophile bastard, mm-hmm. but his life was shit. They just he, his family. Just he was everybody around him. Everyone's exploiting everybody. Yeah, that's nobody's. That's, it's just horrible. It's weird. It's weird. Feldman, King Corey Feldman. Oh, that fucking that poor lad. bastard's yeah. life has just been. He's just, just been, been shit. The yeah. things he's seen. Very yeah. odd. I was watching. Um, uh, what's the, the 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 guy that was in uh, Lord of the Rings? Is Sam? What's his name? Samwise Gamgee. Yeah. Well, that uh, he's supposed to be a little turd of a man. He's meant to be, but yeah. I think he was brought up quite well, and he was brought up in Hollywood because his father, Aye, uh, star brat, kind of Hollywood uh, brat, was what do you call him? Um, Gomez. In the Adams family, it was it was his adopted father. His adopted father, but or they Al kept, Julia. No, no, the old one. Oh, the guy with the tash. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, the old oh, one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So they kept they kept him. They had a teacher going to him to make sure he was schooled. He wasn't allowed to he work was, after a certain time. He was supposed time. to be a they lovely kept man. Really strict with him. He was him. supposed to be a nice yeah. guy. Yeah, and he said he was brought up really well. So when he was on set, he went to do the Goonies and then went back to his normal life. They said uh, Feldman was away with partying, partying, and with people that were far older in that, and his parents weren't well, there. Drew Barrymore was like terrible. drinking with Jack Nicholson and all that shit. What the fuck? They're all clubbing. Can what was that Studio Fifty Four? Oh yeah, they're all going there. What the, what's so going fucking on? Eight year old. What the fuck is going on there? It's not they right, don't, man. They don't like seeing anything. Nobody talks out of school in Hollywood. If you start saying actually, you just didn't work again. Brad Pitt. 
Yeah. Brad Pitt tried to, well, went to strangle, what do you call him? Uh, with Weinstein. Weinstein. Is he yeah. still alive, the whiner? He's still going, he's still going. He's prolapsed penis. Oh, he's a piece of shit. Yeah, he had COVID, but he survived. Uh, well, how long did he get in jail? Because hey, Maxwell will get similar. No, I, don't, I don't think you can fuck I it. don't know what he got, but it's just but horrible fact, people. Well, this, is, this sums the whole thing up. The Maxwell siblings, the other two cunt faced the the, mm-hmm. the, the brothers. They said it's just terrible. It wasn't a fr- it wasn't a fair trial. Can she said a good lawyer and everything. <laughs> yeah, better than you and I would get. She says, Kid, she's in this terrible conditions. She's not been able to get a good. Def- you like it's a prison. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. That'll I be the worst thing. She'll have been able to do that her whole yeah. life. Can. She's, not, she can. she's not taking her tea bag out of the cup. That's right. And now she's in Piece the fucking shit. cell. Oh, it's good. And it's like, good. Fuck, just treat people better then. Did you see the list <laughs> she had to all the staff? Don't look at do, don't look him in the eye. Uh-huh. The, the tea has to be a certain temperature. All oh this. My God. Kenny likes his socks this way. She was just a fucking piece of shit. Yeah, I love that she's in you jail. You and I should have driven over us. That's what I'm saying. You yeah. Wouldn't, she wouldn't have met us because the only way she would have met us if we were doing something for her. Yeah. She wouldn't have spoken to us. She wouldn't have interacted. Horrible them. people. It's awful. And she's going to jail. She is going to well, jail. Well, this country's it's run wonderful. by... This country, the Prime Minister of this country is the same kind of person. Yeah. Just pieces just of shit. This guy that just rattles through life. They couldn't even... He couldn't even answer where he was for 10 days. <laughs> they said to him, where have you been? <laughs> no idea. <laughs> no idea. Where, where have you been? He wasn't lying. He just didn't he just, know. He's like, I was in the country. They're like, no, but it's an emergency. Where, where have you been? <laughs> I don't know. If I didn't <laughs> show up at my work, where have you been? I don't <laughs> fucking know. Get me for fuck ten out. days. Get the fuck out. And the amount of jobs that I've literally missed the bus to get there, and then the boss is waiting on you. Go, where the fuck are you? The being? problem You're is like, there's no shame anymore. Mm-hmm. And I don't. I, I, if I'm trying to say. They do shame people out of existence for certain things, but if you're shameless, there's no. That's there's no right. shame. You just keep. Trucking on, you you just lie there about it. There needs to be consequences yeah. for criminal behaviour. Yeah, you just you, there you, has to you be. get away with it. Prince just... Andrew, you're going to jail. He's not, but I hope that. I mean, he's so toxic now. Yeah, and I hope it stays that way, and I hope it gets worse. You don't. Get, I hope some evidence comes out. Don't forget it. Back in the day, they had such an easy time of it, like in the 60s, all that. You could have been a rapist. Well, Bill yeah. Wyman was a fucking rapist. Yeah, no, absolutely. And you just. You just go along. In the eighties, it was the Bill Wyman, yeah, and then it on the front page with his new wife, she's who was thirteen. thirteen or something, yeah. And people, go, oh well. I think like, the Jerry man. Lee, the fucking what's his name, the blonde-haired Elvis, get yeah, great balls of fire. That was his cousin. But she, she was, was a child. But that was a bit rich for British blood. Yeah, she they was, didn't like him over here. Was he not banned from the UK? For I'm that? not sure, but I think I so. A kid so there's well. certain things that was beyond the pale. I suppose. Well, Jimmy Page kidnapped a girl for a year in his house. And Did he? And she was a child. He's yeah. a, there's a darkness comes off that cunt. It's weird. He bought man. that. Up. What's it called? Not Erskine. Can the 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 Satanist place in the. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, he what's bought it that. called? Um, Crowley's place. Crowley, yeah. Alistair Crowley. He's on the Sergeant Pepper's album, isn't he? Oh, He's one just, of the faces. He was just a clown. He's just they threw idiots. him out of Italy for being a pervert. It's just the Italians Italy. <laughs> <laughs> No, I love it. I was watching. I was watching the uh, is it the Church of Satan in America going around, and they're just such fucking uh, <coughs> full of shit. They're just very funny, but, but they've got good, is, good stuff to I've say. I've heard there's been problems in the ranks. There's been they've been saying there's been a bit of bad behaviour. Oh no! Yeah, don't be a bit bullying and nasty oh, stuff. Oh, don't because everything. Yeah, I'd, the kind of thing is they don't really believe in Satan. No, they don't. They said that yeah. it's not to do with There's Satan. There's a guy with the funny eye that's the leader guy. Yeah, in the it's not to do with Satan. No, it's to do with if a Christian yeah. statue goes up, you they come your, along with yeah. bam yeah. and it, that's very but, funny. No, I, think, good. I think there's been some toxic behaviour. Oh God! Every, as, soon, well. as soon as they get a media profile, as, as soon as there's a big cheese in anything. That's something. It. There's a personality. I thought, is it Charlie Brooker did a thing where he he says how the process works. He says when you're new to this, they, you say you're a say, say you're a writer on a show, and you go along, and they, you, the VIP treatment, and you're like, oh no, can yeah, he, here's your latte, and you're like, oh god, you didn't have to do that. Thanks yeah. very much. Here's your seat, and here's your biscuits. Oh, this is great. Thanks. Second time you go, and you start yeah. to go. Where is my yeah thing? 
and it's very quickly it turns you and you become a piece of shit. Well, that's like winning money or, or yeah. inheriting. Yeah, it does do it. That's, it twists you. I can't remember the name of the condition, but it's recognised. You do change. Just politeness. Endless celebrities have clauses where you're not allowed to look at them. It's so peculiar. It's, I, But I think, not to defend them, that's absolutely ridiculous, but I think that is natural. And I think there has to be maybe people telling them I no, suppose you, you have that. to exist in a world where everybody's not staring at you all the time. It would be very yeah. unpleasant if someone's asking you for your autograph and you're taking a shit or having a, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's true. But yeah, it seems weird. I got annoyed. I was in uh, the city centre uh-huh. and you're just eating my lunch. I was out from work and then someone came over and it was a Christian thing. Oh. And I went, ah, oh, I'm not interested. Next day, same again. Next day, Look, I'm having my lunch. Next day, fuck off. Oh, yeah. I fucking told you, you're the same person. No, they're just you know, wearing you down. So I went from being very polite to just telling someone to fuck off. Mm. It's a similar thing. You mm. can get used to, or you can change your own behaviour quite easily. And I don't like just telling people to fuck off in I the do. street. Oh, I, I know you do. I've seen it. Do. I've seen it. I heard a couple of years ago, I heard this outside this that and there's you strangling someone it was hilarious he was annoying that guy is, <laughs> that guy is a pervert he's a stalker yeah, with elderly right. women yeah. not good so no. ladies and gentlemen it's please, us. that's us please have a wonderful when the clock new just, year you could do one you could wash one ball a minute to twelve yeah. and the other ball a minute after twelve oh my god yeah? a whole year of washing balls that's just a whole and whatever just, Straddle the time with your balls. Straddle I'm, I'm going to do it like what was the Irish comedian with no fingers? Dave, Dave Allen. Dave Allen. Are you thinking of Rusty Ben? No, he had missing F- fingers. Thirty one. No, he had miss. No, no, no. He had missing fingers. He chopped them off at work. Did he? When he was young. Now, whatever God you believe in, you're wrong. So yeah, yeah just just get over it, and have a safe New Year. What do you mean? I'm not joking. Yeah. I, I hope everyone's okay and has a good new year and just let's Take try and survive easy. the next let's, one. I think twenty twenty two will be better. I think it's gonna be, be better. Worse. It's got it's got to Elon be Elon Musk. Is he ever gonna get into the rocket himself? No. I noticed we that. Noticed that. Like, uh, 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 yeah, he knows that's gonna crash. He's, he, eh, yeah, he knows. Fucking old the other kind old Bezos has been up. This this starship, I'm wondering what it's insured for. Wink. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, it we looks like it's a rocket ahead. thing. We could do it. Launch a rocket for the top of here, <sighs> ladies and gentlemen. Wash your balls. Wash your balls. Wash your Until festivities. Next time. Happy New Year. Later. Ta-da, ta-da. Oh.